The pelvic floor muscles roll during strength training. Exercises like sit-ups, abdominal curls, and squats activate the abdominal muscles and can create increased pressure within the abdomen. This elevated intra-abdominal pressure can have an impact on the pelvic floor muscles. Strengthening the pelvic floor muscles is important in order to deal with the increased intra-abdominal pressure on the pelvic floor muscles. Unlike other muscles in our body, such as the muscles in our arms and legs, for example, for pelvic floor contraction, verbal instruction is necessary in order to guide trainees and practitioners to the desired results. In a 2018 study, PhD researchers Noah ben -Ami and Gail Dar found that instructing participants to squeeze the anus was the most effective way to activate pelvic floor muscles with a 90% success rate. If you are concerned about pelvic floor dysfunction, it is best to begin by focusing on contracting the pelvic floor muscles without incorporating any movement. Gradually, you can increase the time of contraction and start to incorporate these contractions into additional exercises. It is important to prioritize avoiding excessive strain on your pelvic floor muscles by refraining from holding your breath while exercising. Instead, concentrate on maintaining a steady and consistent breathing pattern. Note that if you have any concerns or are at risk of pelvic floor dysfunction, it is always advisable to consult with a healthcare professional or a qualified pelvic floor specialist for personalized guidance and exercises.